Welcome to Techzilla Bytes, feeding your tech hunger fast. I'm Shannon Morse. Windows 8 is fun times once you get used to it. Yes, there are still several annoyances for myself, like trying to switch between a tile app and a desktop windows is not very intuitive, but they did make some things pretty easy. The PC Settings app is one of those things. Through the PC Settings app, you have the ability to customize many items that you need, including the lock screen, default apps, and account information. I'm sure plenty of you guys know already how to find that panel, but a few things were updated with the Windows 8.1 Update 1 and are now found only in your PC Settings app. Now, if you want to customize the lock screen, that can be found under PC Settings, PC and Devices, and Lock Screen. If you try to change your Microsoft account details from the desktop, guess what? You'll get an error saying to change them under the PC settings. So to do this, go over to PC settings app and click accounts. This goes for changing your account credentials all the way to changing your photo and your security settings. Also, changing OneDrive settings are also found in the PC settings tile app. This includes your sync settings, customizing what happens on meter and connections, and buying more storage. Now for the privacy nerds like me out there, you may have noticed that you can use search from the charms bar. Now searches are integrated into a Bing query. Since that's a little bit creepy for me, I choose to turn that off and only search my computer for programs and software. Lastly, you may have noticed that opening your Wi-Fi connections gives you a nice little Windows 8 sidebar instead of a pop-up like on Windows 7. You can still find all of the menu options that you used to in the PC Settings app under Network. Now, go forth, download all the things on your awesomely new Windows 8.1 computer. Why don't you try audible.com for some excellent audiobooks? You've probably heard of Divergent the movie, right? So you can also listen to the audiobook by Veronica Roth, it is so good. I loved it. I listen to it every single day. I wish there was more of it. Oh yeah, there's two more books. Awesome. Audible.com is the leading provider of downloadable digital audiobooks and spoken word entertainment. Go to audiblepodcast.com slash techzilla and get your free audiobook download of your choice when you sign up today. Is your computer feeling slow? Make sure to check out our video on five free ways to speed up your PC. And for more from Techzilla, hit up youtube.com slash techzilla or techzilla com and share what you think below or tweet me at Techzilla. I'm Shannon Morse. Thanks for watching.